and welcome back everyone today we are continuing here in whatever the name of this campaign level is why don't you tell me uh does it tell me valberg that's where we are so we are here in valberg we have made a little bit of progress last episode we put in all of this here and all of this up here and it's been going fairly smoothly although Oh, the starfish is going to die soon, so that's a problem. And I think the solution is actually going to be to change everything I just did. So this guy stays at size 8, so we're going to pick him up, we're going to put him in here. We're going to take the starfish and we're going to move him into that one. Uh, and now, we have to fix all the problems that that just caused. So if we have no muscles to be fed, that one's nice and easy to solve. Bam. And then we need filtration, and that one is also pretty darn base. Boom. Okay, so now you will be fine for now. And you need a bunch of stuff. And the best way to do this is going to be probably move you. You can see I didn't really have a great plan for all this when I started. Because uh, you are going to need a whole bunch of work. Um, right. So, we will use one large filter. We will use one chiller. Two chillers. That solves all of those problems. And we will actually just be really lame and just literally build out an extra tile rather than do anything reasonable and throw it on one of those. And that should solve all the problems. I think, I hope, maybe. How starving are you? Eh, you should be okay. It is going to pop up literally every other day though, isn't it? Well, that's annoying. Use more. Oh, that's all two points for animals view. Yeah, yeah. Um, can I put like two more of those in? I can. Uh, and let's actually go ahead and grab an extra staff member who is good for feeding. There's a two. Two for feeding, one for feeding, one for feeding, two for feeding, not feeding, so you are great just for feeding. Perfect. Consider yourself hired, get to work. Make that a priority task. And you are in the wrong place. Get out of there. Next research, just do the next one. That feeds all of you, which is phenomenal. Theoretically, I should probably actually look at adding another bathroom at this point. Go ahead and do that. It's right down here. Uh, yeah, stuff. Basic bathroom. I'll just do one and two. And then we'll go ahead and just put a wall on the outside of that. Perfect. Right, so let's see. Uh, can we prioritize staff jobs and see if that helps anything? Uh, right, so not really, actually, because. Both of my feeders, their only job is feeding, and both of my fixtures are really prioritizing fixing. At least they will be now. Um, yeah, we'll go ahead and leave it like that. It should be okay. Um, let's see. Now I just want to keep planning. And now I'm gonna go ahead and I guess start looking at the next habitat, unless we have any errors to fix. That's fine. Delete anything that's a growth report. All of my staff are leveling up. 
good, good. Uh, let's go ahead and make you a level 4 fixer. Make you a level 2 fixer. Make you a level 4 feeder. That's nice and handy. Once again, delete all the growth reports. I think I can actually get rid of that pop-up. Let's check that really quick. Uh, options. Interface. Animal growth reports off. Because I don't care when they grow up, I just care if they can't. Everything looks like it's going along okay. It occurred to me that once again I forgot to start the timer. But it's alright, we're only five minutes in. Let's see, what do we need to do next? Oh, we need to pick another research. Uh, you are kind of annoying. You're really kind of annoying. Although you don't eat other animals, which is nice. You take up less space, but you're going to be obnoxious to maintain. Let's go ahead and start with you. I might actually try and put the other... I, I might try and put both mushrooms, both the uh, corals in the same thing. Yeah, they are disco mushrooms, but they are a species of coral. I'm not crazy, I promise. In the meantime, I've got all my cold water critters that I can for now. You eat crustaceans. We can do a nice uh, school of bannerfish with perhaps. Uh, hmm. Maybe some bannerfish and humpback snappers? That seems like it could be cool. They do require a lot of space though. You guys are basically 30 a minimum. And you guys are 3 times 16 would be uh, 48. So between the two of you it has to be a minimum of 78 squares, which means it'd be a good opportunity to use that new tank I got. Cool. I'm down with that. That's going to be really expensive. Olive has leveled up. You are now a level 5 fixer. Cool. Uh, let's go ahead and... See what we can do about basically just making... Like a new wing uh, right here. I just do this. Can I make you just huge? I can. I would like to. Oh, I'm in the wrong mode, that's why. Alright. And then let's see, the fell fast tank. Let's see, dwarf flying fish. Cool. Let's start the last research. Uh, oh, because that's the only place it can be accessed by staff member. Right. So if I made you in there, uh, I can't really center that kind of. Um, you know what? I don't have enough money for that. That would cost me 3,700. That's annoying. Fine. Could do. Oh, nothing else really. Why do you not let me continue longer? Why can't I eat that bigger? Why would you not let me do that? Hmm. I want that to be bigger than it is. I just bump you out by one tile. So we'd like that to be a two all the way around. If I can do that. That's 5,625. That's a little more than I've got sitting around. 
we will hold on to that idea. At a level up here, you get to be better at fixing things. Uh, let's see. Not in the meantime. Why don't we go ahead and bump this out here. What if we did this? If I do this, I've got two grand, I can do a nice corner tank here. To line up like so. And for the time being, we'll just run a wall straight across there. Eventually I'll put probably one, maybe even two tanks there. Filters, give me a power pump here. Because... We will be able to actually run a whole bunch of things to this particular tank, which can hold 23 uh, fish worth, 23 population. And that seems like a good a use as any to put in two of those to take me to 13. You don't eat anything I need to be worried about. I did two of you plus... Uh, plus that hermit crab, maybe? That would take me to 12. I guess I could do like maybe a rabbit fish 17. I could do two, one, and three, and that would fill out the tank perfectly. That's gonna cost a lot of money though. Go ahead and do that. So there's one, two of you. And you're gonna panic, so let's go ahead and pause to get all that situated. Check one, more filter, bam. And you know what? Second, the third, bam. It also requires some heat. I can do that. Bam. Overkill in the heater for now, but we'll need it over time. And you need some cave. Uh, I'm out of money. Pretty much title of this series, I'm out of money. Okay, cool. So there's all that dealt with. I don't remember making it like that. I thought I had a one not one square gap. Uh, it's actually oh, I'm out of money once again. All right, now we kind of just gotta wait. I'd love to say I'm going to speed this up in, in uh, editing, but I probably won't. You guys are probably stuck just seeing it all in real time. We're approaching the uh, approaching the goal, though. That's nice. I, um, I'm not sure what I can do to really speed that up, other than just wait till I've got some money and then get the right fish in here. Hermit crabs are 189, so I could do one of you, but I would actually rather get this rabbit fish in here first, I think. Um, yeah, just the one. Oh, you get stressed when you see things that are outside of your species. Right. I knew that. And you don't like being placed with things that eat your food. Can I put you in there? And you take seven, so of course I can't. That would be too easy. I'll put you in this one. I can't. Aha. Solved that problem real easy now, didn't I? Okay, so. As it turns out, these lionfish just get to live all of them. Let's grab that entire plan. Give you a friend. Hmm. Once again, that could be a problem. Uh, 
I sell you and so I'll move you to be over here. I have a plan. Nobody panic, but I have an idea. I'm operating on a very tight budget. Put you there. Connect you to that. And then... Still put in... Good power filter right there. And I have solved none of my problems. That solves that piece of the problem. Because now I have access to here. Hmm. My whole plan here was really just to do this. Because now I can do this. I guess that solved my issue. That solved my issue better than I expected it to, I'll give you that. Don't love that. We're just gonna kind of not look at it and hope it goes away. I'm also pretty sure I'm never gonna get to build that giant tank that I wanted to because now we're broke. Uh, eh, we're not terrible. We're dipping severely into the red every time I build anything. But that is to be expected. Do need to decorate to make everything nicer. Because these do actually add all, all add prestige. Uh, and as such, let's just go ahead and kind of be cheap about it and like focus on things where we can spend all the money. Like that. I guess it's not a ton, but it certainly helps. Some rocks. Nope, I'm out of money. Yeah, see, so now we're we're basically pushing the brink at 600, climbing even a little bit. I don't think we're gonna hit 630. Yeah, never mind. Yes, we are. I'm just outright lying to you. Cool. So we get a whole bunch of new stuff. We get a new plant. I'm uh, oh, sorry, but you get a new paint and a new plant. Rocks, decor, one, two, three, fish, a new type of coral, pillar, and the Depa filter, which is basically specifically for, uh, um, like coral habitats and whatnot. Which is cool. And we have to do gift shopping stuff, which is okay. Uh, let's see, what do we want to start with for ecology? Probably... Uh, probably these guys actually with the next anemone, and we definitely want the double filter on there. That'll be insane soon. Daily revenue has to climb, prestige has to hit 900, and we have access to... I thought we had access to the gift shop stuff, maybe we don't. Uh, apparently we don't. Can I get that when I level up? I have no idea. Can I... There we go. That's why. Uh, so we need to get a guidebook. Uh, place a guidebook shelf, place a book supply, sell a dozen guidebooks, get money. Uh, guidebook trial, we've got a level up here, we're gonna have a level up on cleaning just so you can handle that. Gift shop. I should just put this right in like that. Got a little bit of money. I'm gonna go ahead and actually like 
basically turn this into a little tiny storeroom. Alright. And back here, I think this is a fly crate. Let's put you in like that. That means now I need to hire somebody who can handle gift shop responsibilities. Looks like it's going to be Benny. Don't let your guests have access to the boxes. Make sure you've got somebody who can handle the restocking, and you'll make money. These things sell for 12 bucks, and you can actually bump that up to like, I don't know, 15, whatever you want to bump it up to, really. They do cost you money to buy those, so make sure that you're making a good, you're making a good turnaround. I do love when people buy one just to walk out. Go ahead and make sure we get some nice padded benches. Do one there, do one here. Put one there. Could help out with everybody's exhaustion. At this point, we've got six grand now because we are making thousand dollars a day, which is pretty darn nice. Right, so we've got a level up here. We're gonna make you better at fixing things. Right, do we want some common cuttlefish? Right, and I want a French angel, uh, angelfish, and that is not a thing I have yet. And. Well, that's an interesting one. Kiki leveled up. You're better at feeding now. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna come back to that. Pop ups keep happening. Click that. Do not want to pick another ecology project. Pause the game so that I can actually come and read this thing properly. They're doing research on the moon jelly. Uh, they need a special tank that provides constant flow, as evidenced by this one here that says they need flow. Uh, cold water, they get bigger, all that jazz. Uh, hip, hip, um. <laughs> uh, range of suppliers can provide upfront capital. They need us to operate it for the period that they say. Make sure that they are happy for two minutes. Three grand now, and another three grand after. Or doing all the things. Okay. Sure. I've never actually had moon jellies. Can I? How do you get shaped? That's uh, an annoying number. Hmm. And for anyone who's wondering, I cannot, as far as I know, yeah, I can't build any further out that way. Uh, otherwise, I would absolutely love to. That's so why I think we're actually going to go ahead and place this here. Um, so if I grab this, that arrow, of course, as usual, indicates the direction that it gets uh, uh, approached from. And that is apparently as big as it gets. So let's go ahead and line you up right there in the middle. Cool. Put wall in like that. Wall in like that. I do want a platform. I do want a stair. So that's cool. So you can go up, by the way. I didn't actually know that. Uh, and yeah, we'll just do it like that. Okay, so that's nifty. Uh, animals, they are the cold water jellyfish, I believe. Yep. Uh, and they require. You, know, you do also get animations if you haven't noticed, which is neat. Um, so what do I need? I need six of them in total. We'll keep it paused while I do all this. One, two, three, four, five, and six. 
and I don't think you've done that. I'm actually not sure. Where do you get? Oh, you don't grow. Cool. Okay. Or no, you do grow. You grow to size six at, over time. I think it hold 32, and I'll just put six of them in there, so that's literally not even enough space. Can I make that bigger? Oh, I can't. I wish I would have been paying attention to that. Okay, new plan. Move this tank over here. Sell all of this. Push you back by two tiles. Build a new habitat. That like that. And that should be... yeah, that's big enough now. Now I can move each of you into here. I don't want to buy these fish multiple times. It's always more uh, cost effective to simply move them. Again, let's can I adjust you? I cannot. I am all about the misclicks today. Regular size. A little one of those. And now go ahead and push the wall out. And you okay. So where was that? I need uh, to be able to feed them. Nope. To be able to feed them is going to be one of the most important things. Put that down like that. I'll be able to get back there, of course. So go ahead and get that one in there as well. We are way over time, but I'm going to go ahead and finish this out before I can do that. Do the outro, that is. Uh, so let's see. Sufficient water quality and sufficient temperature. If I go to here, grab a basic pump. Yeah, basic pump. And then come back in here, grab the... I don't know if I want one of those. That's for. Um, now I need a killer. Let's start with that. It does handle that. If I grab you, do you work? You appear to work. I just have to hold this for two minutes, and as soon as that two minutes is up, I'm ending this episode. We will do the next uh, combination of tasks and whatnot in the next one. These jellyfish are pretty darn cool. Can I give them any plants? Velvet horn. Yes. Boom. Alrighty. I have unlocked a new thing. Start the next one. Wait, I lied. Start the next one. Alrighty, we have completed that task. With that, ladies and gentlemen, thank y'all for joining me. Just a quick little overview here of what we have accomplished. Uh, we still have room for that massive tank over here, which we are approaching the ability to actually pay for. Not that I'll be able to afford anything in it afterwards. Looks like we do need to put down a couple more toolboxes as well. But we're making progress here. We've got animals for days. No empty tank at this point, which is great. No problems either, which is even better. And yeah, life is good. All right. Thank y'all for joining me. If you're enjoying it, stick around. I'll have another one up soon. Other than that, though, appreciate you being here. And adios.